Dude, I missed you. I missed you so much. I can't believe you're oh, back. God. I didn't know you. I didn't know. Oh. oh. Welcome back to today's oh. video. He moved back from Guatemala. Oh, I cannot I believe don't. it. It's been so I long. I never moved. I can't believe. Okay. I, I thought you were gonna be you're gonna gone for the winter. You're gonna come back next year. Oh, it's so good to have you back. Oh, I thought I thought you left. I had to get Dylan to replace you. I had no one to talk to in the vlogs. Okay, okay. Oh. Okay, okay. Guatemala was great, but I couldn't deal with it. I missed my boy. The humidity yeah. was too much for yeah, him. Yeah, no, the lack of goose, there were no geese there, okay? What's up guys, welcome back to today's video. Calvin was sick, okay? He didn't Twice. he he didn't move to Guac Guatemala or Guacamole. Got, he, Guacamole. He, he didn't move to Guacamole. <laughs> he, I got RSV from this guy behind the camera. If you don't know what RSV is, it's like an STD, but it's transmitted. Oh. <laughs> you had it too! That's why he had it. <laughs> and then I got Rona from Sam during the desert trip. Shout out to Sam. Sam's the one who rolled the razor. He's back. I'm back. Dude, I had to I had there. to get Dylan. I had to have him come be there to replace you. He is he's he's a handsome guy. Complete opposite of Mm -hmm. <laughs> I was like, hey, if Calvin's character can't be here, I'm just gonna go for the exact opposite. But anyway, uh, before we start today's video, I wanna let you guys know that we just dropped seven new sweatshirts, four new t-shirts. Oh, this one? It's all stuff. No, not this. This, this he's been, he's been he's gone, gone, boys. Oh, he's been gone. He hasn't been here. These dropped on uh, December 1st, but these were originally t-shirts. We've been waiting for the winter, so we have a bunch of new sweatshirts. from our favorite designs in the last six months. We also brought back a couple of our OG favorites. Oh, this is my this is actually my favorite. Yeah. I love the camo and then the monies. So all of this stuff and that's notorious, like what Calvin's wearing right now. The original more money on car parts. I like this one. That one's in black camo. So all the stuff is added right now for every $5 you spend gets you one entry towards winning our E90 M3. The giveaway goes until December 22nd. And guess what? On Crema morning, Crema I'm Chrysler? A, I'm gonna call one of them, be like, congratulations, Mary, Mary Crema. Chrysler. You just won the E90 M3 <laughs> because you spent more than $5 on the website. So if you haven't gotten yourself something yet, pick it up. Just just dropped a whole bunch of new stuff. Click the links down below at thehundredcompany.com. Boys, big video coming today. Stack chips by whips. whips. Right there, bang. Big video coming today. It's time to say goodbye. What, eh, to me? No, again? no, you're back. <laughs> Are you leaving again? Are you going on a trip? Ah, it might be uh, uh, Argentina this time. Oh, okay. Well, speaking about trips, it's time to go and take one. Let's go, boys. <laughs> Amazing, a Gen 1 V10 R8 sounded. It almost sounds better than like a Gen 2. That sounded amazing. I wish we had more like room to do some pulls. That's one of Calvin's favorite cars. I love the R8. This is Calvin's first time in the G82 M4. Calv, initial thoughts, initial impressions. What do you think? Great color, by the way. I love how this car feels. It feels, I see why people buy BMWs. Dude. I kind of want one. This is a beautiful car. It feels comfortable. The sound is great on the inside. Because the car sounds like butthole. <laughs> Everyone knows it. And it looks cool. That's why I love driving the Super around, because it felt great inside. Rip. 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 Uh, should anyone tell her that her hood is open? And I can tell you by experience, if you go like above 50 miles an hour, I kind of want that hood's gonna go. Kinda, we're gonna see it on the news. Do you want to tell her? Let's roll up and be like, your hood's down. Your hood's open. Huh? Your, your hood's, hood's open. open. Your hood's not latched down. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Dude, that would have been bad. <laughs> I'm in the G82 M4 right now, and I'm gonna be using the Carly OBD2 scanner to clear a code that I've gotten from certain mods that we have put on this car so far. The Carly OBD2 scanner is universal to all makes and models, and it's actually a very useful tool that I like to have because it can diagnose problems, it can clear engine codes, and give you live parameters of things going on in your car. All you have to do is plug it into your OBD2 scanner, and it's able to give you diagnostics on your car, it's able to check for odometer fraud and behavior of the past drivers. You're even able to do some really cool things like code your car to leave certain lights on or even program your windows to go down. This is a very, very cool tool for all the BMW owners out there because if you don't know, BMWs have such a large coding capability for even doing things like having your headlights do certain things, or turn signals going or taillights going or leaving them on. This tool can unlock a lot. This thing is huge for everyone out there who gets that pesky check engine light. They always need to be reset. And if you ever go to the track, you do any spirited driving, the live parameters display allows you to see your oil temps, your boost pressure, 
finishers. It's really cool and useful to have because it's all mobile app on your phone. And right now by using my code TJ Hunt, you guys can get 15% off of your Carly app by clicking the links down below in the description. Take advantage now, use it for the holidays. You guys can thank me later. Thank you to Carly for sponsoring today's video and now let's get back to it. Listen, hold on, hold on, hold on. He's you, about to. You need. You he's did, about to talk. He's you, about to talk. Okay, so no. here's what I've been talking about. about it forever. So you can just tell them. I, okay, I'll tell him. I said, Cal, this car is cool. He's like, oh, I thought this was the four door. I was like, nah, it's the two door. I was like, I wish it was the four door. The two door is kind of ugly. No, it is. No, okay, it's, it's kind of ugly. Okay, the four door. He is does this every single time. So I know someone in this video watching it right now knows what I feel. He says it every single time about every car. The C8, B or Z, whatever other car. Oh, the the. The the 400. He says this about every car. Oh, I, did say I think it, I think this is ugly. And then hey guys, welcome back to the video. It's growing on me. I'm sick and tired of it. Stage on boo every time. All right, all right. He he do be kind of right every though. Every car. Uh, two weeks from now. Hey, it's kind of growing on me, guys. The color at this light on this angle, no. the rear. End, all right. Gives we get it. A hard on. We get it. We're here. A hard on. Wait, I didn't say that. What? Eh? What? This is the wrong platform, my boy. <laughs> Anyways, we're here at West Coast Exotics. We're gonna go visit someone today. And uh, if you ever come to West Coast Exotics and you're trying to sell a car or buy a car, all you need to do is go in through the front entrance, look left, and look for the women's bathroom. Because our boy Hunter works in the women's bathroom. I'll go ahead and show you. Open the door, walk in. One, two, three, four, five. Look left. Oh, the sign's covered now. You know what, it's probably, oh, wait. There it is. And then you'll be able to see Hunter, which he's not here. So let's go find him. If there's one car I regret, it's my UV perp. I'll be real with you. I wish I still had it. Sabrina has asked me a million times, TJ, what should I get you for Christmas? TJ, what should I get you for your birthday? Cause my birthday is four days after Christmas. I'm not gonna tell her boys, but just link her to this video and just Instagram message her and be like, Sabrina, you could really make TJ's Christmas. And Sabrina, you'd get a great viral video of you surprising your boyfriend with this car. I don't know. I'm just gonna, I'm, I'm gonna leave it to you. I'm gonna leave it to the power of all of you because man. Comes with the cage already. It's just clean. I'm actually Santa. I have a present for you. Oh my gosh. Santa. So what you guys don't know is Hunter's a big fan of the Veil side that we built and he really Huge wants fan. one. He hits me up all the time. He's like, TJ, can I buy it from you? Can I buy it from you? And guess what? I'm like, no guys, I'm not selling no British racing green car. So I- Put I, it in the comments. I haven't. If we get no. one, okay. How many likes? No. How many likes? I'm not selling How many it. likes on the video? I'm not selling How many it. likes on the video? I don't even think I, I don't even think I could do it. I love that car. At least for right now. I, I brought you this shirt. Because you don't have it. Oh, great. I could wear this. So then I won't ever have to see the car because it'll be on my back. That way I'll never be sad about yeah. TJ not selling it to me. Yeah. Why won't you sell it to me? Because I think you love it, but I love it more. Well, one, I need to stop selling British Racing Green cars because I hate those comments. And two, I really like it. I really do. We have some business to do today. Yeah. They don't know what car it is yet that I, I brought here today. Told. I haven't told them yet. Before, I just, I'm going to browse the inventory. Every time I come here, they always have really cool set cars. And I just, I like, I like to browse. So let's go browse inside. I just noticed they have a UV purple that hasn't even been listed yet. We're going to play my favorite game to do when I come in here. We're going to play what car would I take home if it were free? I'm going to have Calvin go first. This is it. This is my pick. It was between this one and the 720 over there. I don't ever want to believe that McLarens are always in the shop, but TJ tells me it is. I'm I didn't want to believe. Tell me, but then I keep following videos of people who own it, and they just keep saying my car's in the shop. Shout out Alex Choi. He actually uses his McLaren, and that thing breaks every other day. So 488. 488. I gotta be like, honest, it's not what I suspected you'd pick. Fantastically beautiful. It would be that guy, but I don't like that car. But what? this one. Okay. All right, by no surprise, this is my pick. An absolutely perfect automobile from head to toe. Missing a couple things. It's missing the carbon wing with a red Porsche on the top, but nothing, nothing to fret about. I just want you guys just to come back at this rear three quarter and tell me that this is not an absolutely perfect car. The sound, the looks, I mean, I'm biased. I love Porsche. This is the best car here. The color, the spec. With a, with a pair of, of E89s, polished lib, gold face. Just saying. Man, you can't have a car that you want to drive and it goes wrong. You just turn it on and drive it. <laughs> That's the goal. I was actually gonna walk over to the UV perp and be like, legitimately, I wish I could have this car back. That's what I was gonna do, but for the spirit of being different, I would probably take the 765. Did, did we get to drive one? Or was no, that, that was a 720. I would take the 765. The reason why I, I was gonna pick this or that one, I wanna go for a spring. Billionaire boy doors. You know what I'm saying? Ooh, that is very true. This you is know, a gorgeous spec though, with the center seats and everything. You it's know my, you know my B or Z has Lambo doors. It does. It does have Lambo doors. True, true 
out of the factory doors like this. Fantastic. <laughs> Just look at that. That's one of my favorite things too about McLarens. I drove Dylan. You know how you have 570S? Yeah, yeah. You can click down, that's technically an upshift, right? So you click down on the paddle like this, oh. an upshift, you can shift with one hand. Oh. This mechanism right here, whatever this technology, I don't know if it's technology, but the fact that you can upshift and downshift with the same paddle, it, it's so it's cool. awesome. Yeah. The 765 with this like metal mesh, like weird hex design that just like kind of fills the rear end is one of the sickest things. Everybody likes performance memes. Never me, not ever. Past Cal have got my back. I will never mess with performance stuff. I just want something that makes me feel like I look cool. There you go. I like, like that. When I drive by a semi truck and the reflection is me, I'm like, that's my boy. I think this is probably one of the sickest rear ends. Well, definitely on a McLaren. But... I don't know why you would ever get rid of your billionaire boy doors and get a convertible. I think that's ridiculous. No, it has doors still. What do you mean? I'm poor. Hunter! Sorry. 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 He's four. I'm <laughs> <laughs> Guys, this is not, I can't sit in things. That's a bad, I have a rule for myself is I don't sit in cars. I don't intend on well, buying. Well, because you were talking about the center seats and you're sitting there. Okay, I talked about it off camera. Yeah, I wouldn't get the center seats. They're, I mean, they're very cool. They're super cool, but like, I don't know. I, I wouldn't, I, I wouldn't do the center seats. And look behind you. Whoa. Yeah. Wow, this car looks so expensive. Me and Anthony were just having a discussion off camera. This car is me. So yeah, that, that's a bit of a curveball that I picked that car. But this car is me, wide body. This is me. I, this was the one I would pick. And Anthony said that if you let the accessory mode just do its thing. So I heard from somebody that owns a McLaren that if you turn on accessory mode and let all the electronics start before you actually start the car, it like eliminates most of the problems. Kind of a theory, maybe not true, maybe true, I don't know. Pseudoscience, but if pseudoscience works, is it a problem? Let's address why we're actually here. We're getting rid of a car today. This is a car that I think some of you should have seen coming. I think we even mentioned this a few different times before. We have no need for this car anymore. Although it is beautiful and amazing and sexy, it kind of just sits and I don't like just I don't want to have cars just sit anymore. I have too many cars that just sit. So it's time for this car to say its goodbyes. Sabrina, unfortunately, didn't have the heart to come here and drop it off today. She wanted me to do it. She was like, I'm gonna get too emotionally invested if I drop it off. She's actually sad to see it go, but we just don't really have any use for it anymore. And I hope one of you guys comes and buy it. So it's gonna be here at West Coast. This is actually where my other C8 is right over there. So we're gonna park both of our C8s and see them off together. So if you come here and be like, go inside, go left, look for the women's bathroom, and you're gonna find Hunter. And then you know what? TJ is actually gonna give this C8 to you guys for free yes. if you purchase the twin turbo car at $349.99. Yeah, yeah. This one is free. There you go, if you buy that free. car. I actually saw some people that were curious on the price on that, and all I'm gonna say is look up the full twin turbo kit is from LMR, and look at how much the Street Hunter wide body kit is for that car, and then paint body, and then wheels, and then the Brembo brakes. That car is actually a steal. It's about 100 grand less than yeah. For to buy it, it would be a hundred grand less than what it would take to actually build the car. I saw and some then even comments. If you could build, I know. And They're here's like, the I, thing. It's like, I think you just oversold the car. I'm like, no, TJ's losing money on that car. He's losing a lot of money that he actually paid for, yeah. by the way. So now I'm gonna have both of them. So if you are interested in the C8, this is an amazing spec. We actually don't have the TE37s on the car. One thing that Hunter always tells me is like, TJ, please bring stock the cars wheels. on stock wheels just because customers usually like to do their own wheels, which I would totally get. So I'm gonna sell her TE37 separately. So if you have a C8 and you actually want her wheel set up with tires, DM me, we'll figure it out. But this if, is not gonna be for sale. If you guys DM TJ and he doesn't reply about the wheels if you're a serious buyer, then hit me up and Hunter I will relay it to TJ or you could just buy them from us, whatever works. Or if you want them on the car, we could work something out too. You're such a great salesman. Oh wow. Dude, oh, it's goodness. like you do this for a living. It's almost like that. What do you mean? I, I work it in and out. Oh yeah, I was just there. You, you should have actually me. got me. That's a big story. I'm not even going to get into that. I ask him to go to lunch every time I come here and he never comes. Oh, okay. It's Roast Hunter Day. It is. It's always Roast Hunter Day. This car is, it's going to be sad. This is a really big car for us for Street Hunter too. because it has the full Street Hunter catalog. You have a duck bill, rear diffuser, side skirts, extended boomerang vent, hood, and you have the carbon lip. And Sabrina's car was opted with the carbon roof. So this car is just dripping in carbon and it has the red guts interior. 
and we just got the front dash replaced with brand new leather so the car is literally in mint condition it's a perfect spec if anyone's trying to get into a great car this is it and another shameless plug my twin turbo c8 is for sale if you guys are interested contact hunter at west coast exotic <laughs> This thing is so insane and I almost don't want someone to buy it and I will take it back and do something even crazier with it. But that's a whole other story. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas for TJ. I don't need it. Yes, you do. No, I don't. Yes, you do. Hey, it's no. right under the tree, Teach. I know, and it's red. Merry Chrysler. Porsche. No. Merry Porsche. I'm getting out of here, dude. Hopefully one of you guys buys my C8 or Spirit C8, I'll meet you here. And I'll you say hello. You don't come back here until your C8s are sold, okay? All right. We're back at the shop. I haven't picked up the camera in quite a while, but that's because there are so many orders to pack out and we are trying to get them done as soon as possible. So we're gonna spend this evening here at Hunco. Co. We're gonna pack some orders. I wanna say again, big thank you to everyone who's purchased anything and is entering to win a giveaway. It means a lot. We're working really hard. We're putting a bunch of overtime hours. Anthony back there is working overtime hours and is helping us pack and we have a bunch of friends coming tonight. This was supposed to be a time lapse, but for anybody who gets their package and it's packaged absolutely perfectly like this, folded over, your boy. No, that ain't me. You get your package and your shirt is stuffed in there and it seems uncomfortable. That's that guy. That was from me. Carlos Fluencio, Riverside, California. What's good, baby? We just got home. It's now close to 10.30. Put in so much extra hours to try to get caught up. There are there's just so many orders. I could have filmed and done time lapses for literally hours and hours and hours of footage, which I, I obviously didn't want to do. But um, I'm exhausted, guys, from this early start to this morning to putting in all that extra work. I'm toast. KO. Good night. Finito. I'm done. I'm going to go to bed and hit the hay. I just want to say thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. I love you. I cannot wait to see you guys tomorrow. Vlogmas is going great. I think we're on Vlogmas day eight. We're only a third of the way through. If you've been coming back every day, I truly appreciate you. And um, I look forward to seeing you guys in the next video. Peace out and keep moving forward. Aren't a thing anymore. Get the video's over. Get out of here. Go away.